Alrighty, hello everybody and welcome back to the channel and this this is going to be an interesting video, but um, I just want to say thank you to EA for providing me early access to this so that I can do some videos for you guys ahead of time. Um, but yeah, so this video is going to be all about The Sims 4, my first pet stuff, and I do want to say that I have saw and read so much negativity when it comes to this pack and I'm looking forward to going in and kind of seeing like exactly why um and kind of you know given my thoughts basically so um so when you first open up the game after getting it it gives you obviously some description about everything which I love when they do that or love that they do this so it says Care for a new pet. Add a habitat to your household with all new small pets like a hamster, rat, a pygmy hedgehog, or a miniature bul bulbous. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Um, have your sims name their new pet and learn how to take care of them. Um, dress your cats and dogs. Show your sims and their pets and their pets are made for each other with matching pet outfits like a comfy robe and perfect pajamas put a glamorous dress on your feline friend or have a, your dog don a hat for the right occasion um decorate with pet prints have sims decorate their living room with unique designed decor and paw some pet inspired furniture for the kids room from cute cat pillows for your sim to bright bright for your sims to bright beds for your cats and dogs there's something for everyone so that is what you see when you first pop open this game and I'm going to go ahead and just jump into cast and kind of show you guys all of the new cast items. There isn't very many um, so this is going to be super quick so I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys obviously the dude because that is what we got first um, and I heard from other people that had oh they said that there was no little thing for my first pet like a like a little um clicker to to you know find everything but there is so anyways this is the new hair um you can actually get it for female as well um so i'm not going to show you guys this on the female because it it's the same one and com comes with obviously all the base colors you know um i actually don't mind this hair um i i think I think it looks good. <clears throat> it is definitely something that I see on boys a lot. <clears throat> I have to clear my throat. I'm like talking way too much right now. Um, but I do personally enjoy this hair. I think I'll be using it a fair amount. Um, and it's always nice when we have new boy stuff because we honestly don't get that much. So it's nice when we do. So, um, yeah, but we're going to go ahead and click that. So there is no new accessories, um, no new hats or anything like that. So just a new hair. Um, I'm going to see if there's any new styled looks. Um, there is. So I believe that it's probably just this one. Yep, just this one. So this is going to show you guys the shirt that we get. Um, and it comes with a couple different swatches. Doesn't come with all of the little swatches, but um, it comes with a dog one. It comes with like Dalmatian print um, and that and then a cat one. So that is the new shirt that we get. Um, <clears throat> it's right here. Um, it doesn't show this colored fold print, um, but that is the only shirt we get for the female and the male and I think the female has a couple more swatches so I will show you guys that um right now actually um let's go let's go do female um and yeah but this is the new hair um for the female and I just I'm gonna have to place down another sim because it just does not look good on that that face um let's do popular now um that's perfect because it has a cat already and I'll just I'll just age the cat up if need be so there we go okay so let's do let's do the hair so this is the new hair for the girls and personally 
it's not bad. There's like a weird clipping issue right there. Unless that's how it's supposed to be. But it definitely looks weird on that side. It's not bad. Um, but it's not my go-to. I don't know. I just don't, I don't personally like it. Um, it does like fit like the colorful hair colors because it kind of gives like a punk vibe. So, I mean, maybe for the colorful hair colors, then it looks weird. I don't want to show you guys that side because it looks weird. Yeah. Um, but yeah. And then there's also this one, same one, but it has like kind of like an ombre effect, but, um, yeah, I don't know. It's not my cup of tea. That's for sure. So there's that. Um, I don't know. Oh, that's from City Living. So there's that. But there's the shirt for the girls. And it get, just gets one more little swatch, which has a cute little hamster peeking out the, the pocket, which I don't know why they didn't give this to the boys. I don't know. But I think it's cute. Um, and then do we have any outfits yet? Yeah. Oh, duh. We have this one. Yep. It's a big old hamster suit and it's kind of funny. And if you guys watch the live stream, then you may have seen this. Um, when your Sim dies from the new death, they turn into a hamster and this is, this is what you get. Basically it's, it's, it's interesting. So, um, but okay. So there's nothing for that. So let's go to children. I don't know if there's anything. Oh, there is something new. So actually, okay, that, oh, that's from all from City Living. So this is the new um, shirt that comes for the children. I'm sure it's the same for the guys as well. So there's only, you know, those swatches and then this cute little hamster. Um, there is this cute new um, onesie, which is adorable. Um, it comes with Oh, comes with Christmas. Okay, maybe that's a hint of season. Mm, who knows? Um, but there's th just a couple different swatches. I think they did good on this one. Um, I definitely don't see this as an everyday thing, but for sure a little, like, uh, a sleep, which you can. Um, so there's that. Um, I don't think there is any new pets. I just recently reinstalled all my games, so that's why everything's popping up. So I think that's it. Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure there's nothing for the toddlers besides, like, the same stuff. Um, this little cute little, oh my, Lanta, it looks so cute on them. <gasps> Dude, my entire family could match, like, all of my kids, all of my pets, oh my goodness, shh. Man, man, man. Oh my goodness. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and go over to the animals and we're going to do the cats first. Um, so basically this pack is something that works with cats and dogs. And if you don't have cats and dogs, you're not going to have everything, which is kind of a downside in my opinion of this pack. You kind of have to, you know, have cats and dogs to get the full you know, amount of stuff. What do you want, Shadow? Or Casper? Weirdo. Um, the full use of this pack. Um, so it does come with five new little outfits, which I don't personally use, but let's go ahead and get them up here. There's a llama. Um, and it comes with, it's just like a cape with a llama, a dragon, some blank ones. That looks like a dragon anyways. Um, some, a star. That's cute. And this, this is cute. So this is actually a base game female dress. And it comes with all the swatches that the base game uh, dress comes with. Um, so you can match your sim. So if you have like a cute little dog, Yes, it comes for the dogs as well. If you have a cute little dog and you're that kind of sim, you can have it match and you can have them carry it around. It's, I think it's adorable. Um, and then we just have a plain t-shirt as well with a cute little sweater. Oh my goodness. And this actually was a free update as well. Um, and then we have the famous bumblebee 
Oh my goodness. Do you see those antennas? So cute. And then they also have the cute little thing. It comes with a, a couple of the same swatches. Um, so cute. Oh my goodness. So cute. Oh my God. Um, so that is that. Um, let's go ahead, <clears throat> excuse me, and add a dog. And then this is, is this a small dog? Um, let's do, um, yeah, this is considered a small dog, so the, 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 um, outfits are a little bit different. Okay. Oops. Okay. So it, it has the same little things, um, but this is a little bit different when it comes to the dogs. Um, I can't see all of the swatches. I don't think I hate when they, I hate when it does. That. I don't know why it does, but, um, so there's that. And then obviously the bigger dog has the same thing. And I believe that is all for create a sim. Super simple. Um, uh, mostly buy stuff in this pack for your pets well for for your sims and mostly for your cats and dogs so if you don't have that expansion pack then that kind of pulls a d damper on things so yeah but um so that since this is kind of like the create a sim f like end of it i'm gonna put create a sim and build a bite together and then make a separate video of the gameplay for the hamsters and stuff like that so i'm gonna plop up into game and you know, get a little family together, um, make sure I have a child and stuff like that. Um, so I will go ahead and do that really fast and plop into game and show you guys that, um, the hamster and stuff. So yeah, um, uh, we'll be back in just a second. So we are in game now. So I'm going to go ahead and filter the stuff for my first pet. Um, so this is what comes with it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just kind of place everything and show you guys the swatches and all of that fun stuff. So it comes with two, is it? No, 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 no. It's just one pet, new pet bed. Um, so it comes with this pet bed and it is, it's only for small pets and cats. Um, but it comes in weird, 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 like things personally i only like the monster one um i don't know why they wanted to throw in some random raw meat um and some fruits it's kind of weird i mean the egg and the green egg kind of iconic for like dr seuss and stuff but i don't know personally i don't think they could have should have added like the raw meat um but and then we have this rug which no 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 this is actually a big a big pet bed. Oh, it looked like a rug from a distance, but this one is actually super cute for your animals. Um, has a different like swatches for just a bunch of, uh, uh, pets. And then we kind of have like a monster one. It, I think it's cute. That one anyways. Um, and then we have this cute little chair, which is everyone knows the hamster tummy is where the softest fur is, which is so true. Um, now you can lounge on the lap of snuggly old Hampton the hamster. Oh my God. It's so cute. Um, I love it. It is definitely something I'm going to be throwing into my kids' room so much. I think it's adorable. Um, and then we have this other, this new couch, which goes in like the, the, like it's like a window seat, I guess you could call it. Um, it has regular swatches, um, along with some cute little, uh, animal swatches, which I'm glad that they gave like our, you know, basic colors, not basic colors, but like regular patterns instead of throwing all animal prints on it, which is nice. Um, and then this is, this is another one of, or another, uh, another couch, which has the same, um, little things, but look at that wiener dog. If that's a wiener dog, that's perfect. So cute. And then we have a long cat, um, you know, just that one. Oh, I, I kind of like that one actually. Um, this is definitely something that would be like for your kid's room. Like, I don't think it would be necessarily for, 
your living room, in my opinion. But yeah, it's cute. Um, and then we have a, another little a little side table, which I like. It's a round side table. Um, I, I like. I'll use it. And then we have the tip tap table. Go ahead and set items down on the surface of this aquarium. The fish won't mind a little tapping. In fact, they've been specifically trained to ignore it. So the bad thing about this is, first off, I wanted the round table. I wanted a round coffee table because we have some squared ones and that's basically it. Um, and we have to have the fish in this. There's no option to not have the fish in it which kind of sucks. And the fish already come naturally in it. So you can't put your own fish in it, which is kind of a downfall as well. I don't know why they couldn't make it like a regular, like a regular aquarium. Um, but they also should have given swatches without the aquarium. So maybe um, in an update, they'll add swatches to this to not have the aquarium um, if people request it um, enough, but I don't know. So now we have this kitty litter box, which is adorable. Yes, I love it. Um, it's, you know, it has a bunch of cat swatches, which I adore. We've got like an evil robot. Um, so cute. Um, and then these are the hamster cage. That's the hamster cage. This one's the rat cage. This is the weird ball ballius or whatever. And then this one is the hedgehog, which I will put, I'll go into more depth of these um, later, but I'll just show you guys the swatches that do come with them. Um, so they're super colorful. Um, I like it. I think they did good on the, uh, the cages their, themselves. Um, and then we have a wolf box and a morale box. So it's another toy box for your cats and dogs, which I'm happy about because I wanted a variety of toy boxes for the, the animals, but there's literally two, I think. Um, so I'm glad that they added another, another toy box. Um, and then we have this little, um, whoa, yeah, this little mirror, which, um, is cute. Definitely not something I would use on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, but for a kid's room, yeah, it's cute. Um, and then we have the stump for treats bowl. Even pets aren't immune from our charged political climate. Regular fill their bowl or prepare themselves. Okay. So this is a new food bowl. Um, and it's a, it's like at the bottom of a tree stump, which is odd, but, um, it, okay. Um, it's cute. And then we have two new little cat tower condos um there's this one um and then there's this one like the bigger one comes on the same like uh swatches and then we have this little leaping lamp which again not something i would use on a, like a regular basis but for a kid's room, maybe. Um, it has, like, dogs and cats and even, like, these look like little aliens. I don't know. But there's that. And then we have this little lamp, which I like this lamp. Um, it, it's definitely something different. I like it. It almost looks see-through in a way. You see that? Yeah, it's definitely, like, see-through. Oh, that's cool. Um, and then we have another, a new chair that has like animal ears, a bunch of colorful swatches. It looks plastic, which is so cute for a little kid's bedroom. Uh, we have a new desk for the kids, which I'm happy about. Um, I do. I really like that. Um, and then we have, this is so cute. So cute. I've been wanting something like this, um, for a while. I'm going to go in here and actually add a wall back here just so that you guys can get the real effect of it so um it's right here so there's that yes it is so cute we've got a stack of hamsters a little cat and a like oh my god it is adorable oh my god it's so cute i love that 
Um, and then we have these little decals, which these decals are actually nice. So they come in different different swatches. I'm not going to do it myself, but you can change it up. You can connect it. Um, you can, you can, I think you can, you can do pretty much anything that you, your heart desires when it comes to this stuff, which is, which is cool. Um, um, there's that one. And then there's like these ones and then you can connect that one. I guess I am going to go ahead and do it. Um, and then do we have a swatch for connecting that to the side? Yeah, there we go. There we go. See, I, I like it. I think they, they, they were smart to do something like that. It's definitely different. Whoops. Um, and then we have this little wall art of a bunch of animals, uh, cats and dogs, just different little cute little doodles. So cute. Um, and then we have three new blinds. They're all the same, but they have different, uh, different sizes. So we have a triple, a double, and then a single. Um, comes with all the same swatches. So there's that. And then we have this weird rug. Um, I don't know if I, uh, I'm not too keen on this one specifically. Kind of, it's kind of sad, but all the rest are fine. It definitely would suit a kid's bedroom. There is some plain ones out of swatches out there. That one's so cute. Um, I really hope that they'll add like reptiles and stuff. I really do. Um, so I showed you guys that. This is a new bookshelf. It's so cute. It is adorable, guys. Um, I have to admit, a lot of the items in this is adorable, but there is some reason, like, there are some things that I'm just like, why? You know? But so cute. And then we have a new toy, uh, which this is the new toy. Um, a little hamster cute. And then last but not least, we have a new activity table, which I am so happy about. So this is the activity table. It is so much more detailed. Whoa, I almost knocked down my, my drink. I'm talking with my hands too much. It is so much more detailed than the base game. Um, so these have like, well, not all of them, but some of them have little, little, uh, arts, decals, I guess you could say, on the side. So this one has it, a bunch of cats on that one and some more cats on that one. I don't know about the front. It just has those. And then this one is a dog. Like the, the chair is changing. They did awesome on this one. And then we have some plain ones. Um, oh, these ones have some more cats on it. Okay. So it's the same one as uh, this one. That one's the same one as that one. So just different colors, but I think, I think they did awesome on this specific table. I think they did good. So yes, yeah, so that is what comes in this. Um, it is a stuff pack, obviously. It's not a game pack or an expansion pack. So what you're gonna get in the pack is very limited. Um, but you do gotta remember we did get one main main thing, which was the hamster and stuff like that. So um I'm gonna do a pre uh, or not previous video, another video showcasing you guys all of the the stuff that comes with like the playing of everything. So I'm going to go ahead and do that video after this video and then I probably will do a separate video of my thoughts depending on how detailed I go into the next video. So, but yeah, um, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome day and I will talk to you guys all in my very next video. Bye everyone.